Psalm 69 Prayer for Deliverance from Persecution To the Choir Master According to Lilies A Psalm of David Save me, O God, for the waters have come up to my neck. I sink in deep mire where there is no foothold. I have come into deep waters and the flood sweeps over me. I am weary with my crying. My throat is parched. My eyes grow dim with waiting for my God. More in number than the hairs of my head are those who hate me without cause. Mighty are those who would destroy me, those who attack me with lies. What I did not steal, must I now restore? O God, Thou knowest my folly. The wrongs I have done are not hidden from Thee. Let not those who hope in Thee be put to shame through me. O Lord, God of hosts, let not those who seek Thee be brought to dishonor through me, O God of Israel. For it is for thy sake that I have borne reproach, that she has covered my face. I have become a stranger to my brethren, an alien to my mother's sons. For zeal for thy house has consumed me, and the insults of those who insult thee have fallen on me. When I humbled my soul with fasting, it became my reproach. When I made sackcloth my clothing, I became a bower to them. I am the talk of those who sit in the gate, and the drunkards make songs about me. But as for me, my prayer is to Thee, O Lord, at an acceptable time, O God, in the abundance of Thy steadfast love, answer me. With Thy faithful help, rescue me from sinking in the mire. Let me be delivered from my enemies and from the deep waters. Let not the flood sweep over me, or the deep swallow me up, or the pit close its mouth over me. Answer me, O Lord, for thy steadfast love is good. According to thy abundant mercy, turn to me, Hide not thy face from thy servant, for I am in distress. Make haste to answer me. Draw near to me. Redeem me. Set me free because of my enemies. Thou knowest my reproach and my shame and my dishonor. My foes are all known to thee. Insults have broken my heart, so that I am in despair. I looked for pity, but there was none, and for comforters, but I found none. They gave me poison for food, and for my thirst they gave me vinegar to drink. Let their own table before them become a snare. Let their sacrificial feast be a trap. Let their eyes be darkened so that they cannot see 
and make thy loins tremble continually pour out thy indignation upon them and let thy burning anger overtake them may their camp be a desolation let no one dwell in their tents for they persecute him whom thou hast smitten and him whom thou hast wounded they afflict still more add to them punishment upon punishment may they have no acquittal from thee let them be blotted out of the book of the living let them not be enrolled among the righteous but i am afflicted and in pain let thy salvation o god set me on high I will praise the name of God with a song. I will magnify him with thanksgiving. This will please the Lord more than an ox or a bull with horns and hoofs. Let the oppressed see it and be glad. You who seek God, let your hearts revive. For the Lord hears the needy and does not despise his own that are in bonds. Let heaven and earth praise him, the seas and everything that moves therein. For God will save Zion and rebuild the cities of Judah, and his servants shall dwell there. and possess it the children of his servants shall inherit it and those who love his name shall dwell in it psalm 70 pray for deliverance from enemies to the choir master a psalm of david for the memorial offering be pleased o god to deliver me o lord make haste to help me let them be put to shame and confusion who seek my life let them be turned back and brought to dishonor who desire my hurt let them be appalled because of their shame who says aha aha may all who seek thee rejoice and be glad in thee may those who love thy salvation say evermore god is great but i am poor and needy hasten to me o god thou art my help and my deliverer o lord do not tarry am 71 pray for life long protection and help in thee o lord do i take refuge let me never be put to shame in thy righteousness deliver me and rescue me incline thy ear to me and save me Be thou to me a rock of refuge, a strong fortress to save me, for thou art my rock and my fortress. Rescue me, O my God, from the hand of the wicked, from the grasp of the unjust and cruel man. For thou, O Lord, art my hope, my trust, O Lord. from my youth upon thee i have leaned from my birth thou art he who took me from my mother's womb my praise is continually of thee i have been as a potent to many but thou art my strong refuge my mouth is filled 
with thy praise and with thy glory all the day do not cast me off in the time of old age forsake me not when my strength is spent for my enemies speak concerning me those who watch for my life consult together and see god has forsaken him pursue and seize him for there is none to deliver him o god be not far from me o my god make haste to help me may my accusers be put to shame and consumed with scorn and disgrace may they be covered who seek my hurt but i will hope continually and will praise thee yet more and more my mouth will tell of thy righteous acts of thy deeds of salvation all the day for their number is past my knowledge with the mighty deeds of the lord god i will come i will praise thy righteousness thine alone o god from my youth thou hast taught me and i still proclaim thy wondrous deeds so even to old age and gray hair o god do not forsake me till i proclaim thy might to all the generations to come thy power and thy righteousness o god reach the high heavens thou who has done great things o god who is like thee thou who has made me see many sore troubles will revive me again from the depths of the earth thou wilt bring me up again thou wilt increase my honor and comfort me again I will also praise thee with a harp for thy faithfulness O my God I will sing praises to thee with a lyre O holy one of Israel my lips will shout for joy when I sing praises to thee my soul also which thou hast rescued and my tongue will talk of the righteous help all day long for they have been put to shame and disgraced who sought to do me hurt